Hey, joining us from Grits Farm, we have Alexandra Post. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks for having me. Yes, I know this is a big time for you all right now. So talk a little bit about Grits Farm in case somebody has never been there. Sure. So Grits <laughs> Farm is located in Buffalo, West Virginia. It's been established for almost 100 years now. Wow. And we are currently a three-season plant, produce, and agritourism farm. So we host seasonal events uh, like farm-to-table dinners, planting uh -huh. workshops, and of course, our most popular event, Grits Fun Farm each fall. Yes, and we're looking at some video of some of the things that kids can do and big kids at heart. So <laughs> talk about your farm festival and some of the activities going on so there's truly something for all ages uh -huh. we love having the opportunity to provide unique experiences to people of all ages so we have apple cannons we have goat visits uh -huh. uh, we have a pumpkin patch a corn maze um, sweet treats and uh -huh. so many other things and some new things this year too yeah something new and i think i saw a picture of it a while ago uh your corn do you call it a corn crib what do you call this it used to be called the corn bin bin when okay. it was much smaller so uh -huh. we've upgraded to the corn barn <laughs> it is now the grand corn barn of grits fun farm and there are thousands of pounds of shelled corn in there oh um, it's like a giant pool for people to play in but yeah. it's shelled corn so it's actually a, a great sensory and immersive experience like a big ball pit it is for kids but better yes. much better and is this your corn maze this year it is so that that is an overview of farmyland the corn maze <laughs> it was inspired by the most popular movie of the summer and folks can travel through Farmyland this oh fall and we actually have a brand new game that they can play we call it the Farmyland corn maze challenge so once they get there uh, uh -huh. they'll actually receive a game board and some instruction on how they can navigate through Farmyland and find all the missing Ooh, pieces how fun and of course we saw the goats there that's always fun to stop by and visit with the goats mm -hmm. yep last year we had uh, built the brand new goat barn uh -huh. in and that's running in its second year now, so you can feed the babies and the adult Aww. goats, and um, they love it. They love to be yes, fed. Yes, they do. They're so sweet there. And you're not going to go hungry. Lots of food. Oh, we have so much food to okay. choose from. A uh, crowd favorite is definitely the fresh cake donuts. Yes. Uh, but we also have homemade pumpkin rolls and cookies oh and pepperoni goodness. rolls and um, some other items that are new that are debuting this fall as well. You'll just have to come out to oh, see it. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what is it? that you hope that guests and families and school groups will take away from their visit to Grits Farm? We just love the opportunity to provide something unique to everyone, whether you're local or coming from another state. Mm -hmm. uh, we really appreciate that opportunity, and we want folks to just come back year after year and make new memories and see something new every time mm -hmm. they come back and, and continue on, on that journey with us. And we're just really grateful to, to be able to provide that. Yeah, and it really is. It's a, it's, it's part of fall. It's a tradition. Mm -hmm. Now we were just showing uh, information, ways to contact you all and find out more about there. Do you need to get tickets ahead of time, or can you just show up? Great question. We definitely uh -huh. recommend purchasing tickets online okay. because you actually save $2 per ticket oh. if you purchase the tickets online. However, we will be selling tickets at the gate. So no worries if you can't get them online. We will have tickets at the gate. But uh, we definitely recommend visiting gritsfarm.com because you can see all of the information. Mm -hmm. We've got party packages available if you're looking to have oh. a birthday party or a family That's gathering. A mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, we're open Thursdays through Sundays. Uh -huh. now through October 29th. Okay, so going on the website is also a good way to plan your trip to know what's happening, what's going on there, and you say you have until the end of October yes, to enjoy all of this. Well, Alexandra, thanks so much for stopping by and sharing what you all are doing at Grits Farm right now. Thanks for having me.